All right, this next one is a tennis racket drill. Um, this is gonna fix a lot of you guys who roll, okay? Rolling is usually caused by you casting the bat or you pulling your front side out, okay? Um, so when I swing, I want my bat to stay on plane all the way through the zone, okay? Now, a tennis racket allows us to see that because it has a flat face, okay? A lot of you guys, when you swing, is here and then it's there as you're coming through. All right, you see it rolling. All right, I want to be able to stay inside the ball and snap through. So you're going to take a tennis racket, all right? You need to hold it to where when you come into the hitting zone and the bat is flat, parallel to the ground, we call that bat lag. When you get there, the, the, the face of the racket should be facing the sky and the floor, okay? And you're going to hit the ball with the side of the racket. So because of that, you want to only use wiffle balls on this, okay? Ideally perfect world. I like this drill with front toss with wiffle balls. Uh, if you don't have that access, then you can always set them on a tee, okay? So, same stance you'd always use, <clears throat> same load you'd always use. You're gonna stop at extension, all right? Now I'm gonna try to make sure that the racket stays flat through the zone. So it's load, hit, and I should have my racket still straight as it comes through the zone. And I don't wanna see any of that rolling. All right, so again, Load, hit, and make sure the racket of your face stays parallel to the ground. 